Hey, what is up? Today it's Jake, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about the next Call of Duty Zombies, a theory on how it's linked and how this new Call of Duty, uh, where we're going to go with zombies. So I talked about my last video directly before this video of the campaign and how the title of the new Call of Duty 2015 and uh, how it's set, what the plot is so if you guys haven't seen that make sure you guys check it out it's going to be on screen right now but anyways let's get on with the theory I highly recommend you watch the first video because you're not gonna get shit in this one so anyways let's get started again because I said that again before so anyways main character Ryan Mason in the year 24 or 2 2145 being invaded by the Germans under the power of the Fourth Reich in a new war using wonder weapons we've never seen before. But we have seen these wonder weapons before. We've seen them in zombies. The DG2 Wonder Waff and probably other ones that they've the group 935 has created. Ryan Mason goes back into the past from the future. So it starts off in the future. He goes into an e, uh, EMT, MTD, he goes back in time to change the past. What is he trying to change? The, the group 935, if you don't know who they are, Dr. Maxis and Dr. Richthofen are a part of group 935. It's basically a German scientist organization to improve the human condition, but they make weapons. Dr. Maxis was trying to mass produce the DG2 Wonderwaff giving it to the Nazi party and if the Nazi party or the Nazis and Germany's w army had the DG2 the actual gun that I have on screen right now this gun if they had this gun mass produced in the German army then of course they would win so this is why you're going back into the past is to prevent this gun that I'm holding in my hand right now in the gameplay the DG2 Wonderwaff from being mass produced you're trying to stop that so anyways back to the theory anyways in the end of origins in the end of the Easter egg, you are put into Samantha Maxis's room with her best friend Eddie, and Dr. Maxis calls them down, and Samantha says, "My dad has a plan. What is that plan? We never know until now. In this theory, what is the plan? Well, Dr. Maxis probably still remembers everything that's happened. If not." He's, getting, he's given a second chance to redo Group 935 in a correct way. He is able to redo it again, but probably the right way. Being able to mass produce it because you're trying to stop that. So he was able to mass produce it. That was his plan. His plan was to create Group 935 all over again to win the war. And not just the war, but take over the whole entire world. Some history. What was Group 935? Well, at the start, it was to improve the human condition. But it was to only improve the human condition for the Germans. They don't give a crap about anyone else in the world. Just the Germans, of course. So they're improving the human condition. Improving the war, just for them. And that is, that is Maxis's plan. He probably remembers everything that's happened uh, due course, but he's brought back in time to this new reality that Samantha made in the end of Origins where Samantha's with her best friend playing with toys in a room where nothing really happened, it was all reset. But Maxis probably still remembers. Him remembering everything that's happened creates 935 again, but this is the right way. Doing over the wrongs that he did and making them right and being able to uh, to succeed so all the events from Notchter on Toten all the way to Origins or should I say buried are reset or never even happened but he still remembers like I said before so in conclusion to sum up everything that I've said Dr. Maxis from Origins resets or not not dr maxis but samantha resets time and space 
to a reality that we see in the end of Origins, where she's playing dolls. Maxis says, or, or Samantha says Maxis has a plan. What is that plan? Well, he remembers everything that's happened. If not, he, he has a plan to make Group 935, but is able to do it over again successfully, mass-producing wonder weapons that we know in zombies, and giving them to the German army, and if the German army had these weapons, of course, they would demolish the world and take over. So you're Ryan Mason in the year 21, 20, 2145, so in the future, going back in time to World War II to change Dr. Maxis or ending that or making it not happen, so stopping it. Um, maybe he doesn't stop the mass produce, but maybe he could change events that's happened for him to, for Germany to take over the world. He could change the paths and, uh, make it so they don't take over the whole world or win the war. So he could change that. So basically you're playing as Ryan Mason in the future. Go back in time, change the events, stop Dr. Maxis. So Maxis is the antagonist in this new which is amazing if you love zombies this is a game for you this will be amazing if this is legit now like I said you have to watch the previous video that I made about this it's an email sent to a youtuber will um, of leaks he claims to be the inside source to have Activision knowing this so if this is real I made a video about it but it might not be real, so you got to take this with basically it's a theory, okay? It's not it's not confirmed, so you shouldn't take this as fact, just just a theory. But let me know what you guys think. If you think this is a good idea or a bad idea, I honestly think it's a great idea. If campaign is tied in with zombies, now how is zombies going to fit in? Well, you could obviously uh, have either new characters or the old characters. Um, playing along missions or maps where you're doing easter eggs to stop Maxis's mass produce of the wonder Wolf. or if not that other tasks that uh, help improve other things so anyways if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys leave a like let's try to go for a hundred likes wow that's pretty high that's pretty intense but anyways if you enjoy my content make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and if you guys enjoy videos like this, I'm sure you'll enjoy the next one or previous ones. Why don't you go and check out my other videos? Anyways, I'll talk to you guys next time. Goodbye. I'm out of here.